John Murphy is an independent candidate for the U.S. House of Representatives in the 16th Congressional District. The 16th District includes Lancaster County and parts of Chester and Berks Counties. Hello, my name is John Murphy. I'm the independent candidate for House of Representatives in the 16th Congressional District. 42% of Americans now identify themselves as neither Democrats nor Republicans, and 60% of the American people say they are displeased with the choices offered by the two major parties. I call them corporate parties because they are both financed by the same 1,500 corporations and therefore put the interests of a few corporate CEOs and stockholders above the needs of working Americans. I demand the immediate withdrawal of our troops and all private mercenary troops called contractors from Iraq and Afghanistan. By now, everyone finally knows that neither of those nations had anything to do with the attack on the United States on September 11th. When the federal building in Oklahoma was bombed by the terrorist Timothy McVeigh, we did not bomb his home state of New York. We marshaled the police powers of our nation and brought him to justice. Using the combined police power of our allies is the best way we can bring to justice those who perpetrated the attack of 9-11. But we not only have troops in Afghanistan and Iraq, we have troops quartered in 700 military bases throughout 127 other nations at U.S. taxpayer expense. Those nations are quite capable of defending themselves against an enemy which long ago ceased to exist, the Soviet Union. The United States spends more than the entire rest of the world combined on its military. We can more than adequately defend our nation, yet cut our military budget by 50%. If we do not change the base of our economy from warfare to manufacturing, we will cease to exist as a nation. If we do not take tough measures like cutting the Pentagon budget by 50%, we will never begin to pay down the $10 trillion national debt with which both corporate parties have burdened us and our descendants unto the next three generations. I demand the immediate repeal of the USA Patriot Act, which has gutted the Bill of Rights and destroyed our civil liberties, and the Military Commissions Act, which abolished the right of habeas corpus. I demand an end to warrantless wiretapping and to war crimes like torture and rendition committed in the name of the American people. We must end corporate welfare, whereby hundreds of billions of U.S. taxpayer dollars are used to bail out multi-billionaire stockholders and foreign nations while the American people lose their homes. It's not the welfare queens that are a burden on the American taxpayer, but the welfare kings on Wall Street. If we are a righteous people, we will look carefully at the lies being told to us by the two corporate parties and the compliant mainstream media. Five corporations own 11,000 television and radio stations. Another five corporations own approximately the same number of newspapers and news magazines. All are tied in to the defense industry. The United States has now been ranked 57th in terms of freedom of the press because the corporate media has become the compliant propaganda arm of the two corporate-owned political parties. The corporate parties lack any clear vision for America, they have no real leadership, and they inspire no hope for the future. They have given us a view of the world that is obscured with war, poverty, ignorance, fear, and violence. I have a different vision for America. I see an America that leads the world in spreading peace instead of violence, hope instead of fear, sustainability instead of disaster, freedom instead of tyranny. I see an America in which every person, regardless of their race, creed, color, age, gender, or sexual orientation, is valued and lives in dignity. And every person is free to reach his or her full potential. I hope that by November 4th, 2008, you will share that vision with me and see that there is a home for that vision in the ballot booth, in the column marked John Murphy, representative in Congress. You can find out more about my positions and my background at www.johnmurphyforcongress.org, where you can also sign up as a volunteer and make a contribution. I can't do this without your help. Unlike the corporate parties, I take no corporate or special interest money. Thanks for listening.
The preceding program was brought to you in part by the Corporation for Public Broadcasting and by my source for the open exchange of ideas.